Cause we just keep it down, down inside Yeah, you and I Both longing for expression for the things we like But we stay quiet Hold me now, hold me now Tell me things, tell me all about how you feel Just let yourself go Say it loud, say it Good morning, everyone we are heading to the Windjammer for some breakfast and then we are going to get on our excursion. It starts at 9 a.m. Doing a little wine tasting. Even though we're not wine drinkers, but we did the blowhole and that's about it for Ensenada. Blowhole and wine tasting excursions. There's our chariot. Yes. Let's go. Chariot to the Windjammer. Going up, and it's Sunday. Oh, yeah. It is Sunday. Good morning. Morning. I like your t-shirts. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> They're awesome. We got a carnival ship here with us. Who is it? Uh, Radiance. Oh, Carnival Radiance. I think they were here last time, so it must just be these two ships. Yeah. Kind of quiet. Yeah. I'm gonna go down here. Come on. We're gonna go down here. We're gonna see if we can find a window seat. Yeah, then we'll come back. Right. Okay. Good morning, everyone. We are back in Ensenada, and we're gonna head out today to do a wine tasting excursion, and we will bring you along with us just to show you a little bit more of Ensenada. Meeting up at deck three. Here's our tickets, baby. Okay. Thank you. Hi, good morning. Can you please hand your hands? Yeah. Your number is number two. Please place it on a visible place on your shirt. Follow the path. My colleague is going to tell you where to have a seat. Okay. okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Morning. Welcome. Thank you. All right, number two. If you need to trash some bin, we have trash bin. Oh, no. no? You're sorry. good? Okay, right here, man. Yeah. Follow the two couple there, there. One seat apart, please. Okay, okay thank you. Can you just stick it on your shirt? Yeah. Starts at nine o'clock, so we got about 20 minutes. Okay, we're on our way. I'm gonna taste a little wine. <laughs> Come back tipsy. <laughs> we're not even wine drinkers. Morning. Good morning. Okay, I'm need everybody to have your tickets ready, okay? <laughs> Small group. <laughs> you want to turn? He's going to do it, but like. Oh, well, it'll be easier if you do it. Thank you. <laughs> We're 
We're heading towards the bus. They're waiting on one straggler or a couple of stragglers. For those of you that don't want to do an excursion, they have shuttles that take you downtown for $4. She's the pretty face and I'm the video person. <laughs>
this is our first stop on our wine tour. a ticket that it's worth for uh, four wines okay you guys will get the chili wines um, there's there's some patio benches also and the jam uh, tasting will be inside the building okay right here we'll get inside that's a good question <laughs> We're at our first stop. They give you this little card here. You get to try four different wines. I'm going to have to carry you should back to the bus. <laughs> Too bad we couldn't get some recommendations on what we should try. Uh, one uh, famous grape uh, of the region, it's Nebbiolo. It's a red grape, okay? Uh, that is really good. It's, I'm only recommended if you guys want to try it, but you can choose from different options. Okay? What's your favorite on there? Nebbiolo, uh, it's on the reds, um, uh, fruities, the Grenache is good, Ruby Grenache, but it's not too sweet. Grenache, it's a red grape, uh, and it's made out of like a rosé. That's like a rosé wine, but it, it has more appearance to a red wine than a sweet rosé. And well, Sauvignon Blanc, really good. Chardonnay, also uh, famous in the region. Chardonnay is really good out here. Mm -hmm. the, the last one on the uh, reds, it's a blend. Cabernet Sauvignon and Barbera. That's the last one. That's the bottom. Um, a, little, a little good thing to put your glasses on. Let's go. Mm, let me try the sweet ones. I like sweet ones. Yeah. Anything in that window That's what he said the fruity ones were? Yeah, so I'm just going to... That sounds sweet. Yeah. It sounds sweet. I'm going to try that. Yeah. I'm going to get to try four. But I think I'm going to try all mine just fruity. Let me know which one you like. Yeah. Because I'm going to try one from each category and I'm going to try two from the fruit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which one do you say you're going to get? I'm going to get um, the ruby, the top one in the middle. I thought he said that one wasn't too fruity. Uh, I still want to try it. Okay. The Malagro and honey wine. And what's your? Oh, I need a fourth one. Huh? A fourth one. Hmm. I'm gonna go Chardonnay. Yeah, Chardonnay. That's yeah. what I was gonna say. Okay. Those are those are big shot glasses for you to be able to handle all that. Probably not. I'm just gonna take a sip. <laughs> okay, it's Shook's turn. The ruby. Ruby. And one more. This is the ruby Grenache. 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 To me. <laughs> I'm to carry her back. You carry me anyway. I carry you anyway. But you're going to be walking your own path. I know, I know. There's a lot in there for you. So let's say at this one, I believe he said it's a Chardonnay. Chardonnay. 
Yeah, that's the Chardonnay. Yeah, that's alright. I'm not a real, I guess, uh, yeah. wine <laughs> drinker, so y'all, this would be a lot for me. All right, which one should we taste now? I think I let him pick my fourth one oh, okay. for his recommendation. Oh, I like that. that pretty good. I wonder if that's the same one I got. Mm, I don't know. This one on the end is like so. I'm going to taste it, it's like too much. I don't know. I think it's the same. Let's see, this is the one. I don't remember what he said, which one it was. This is the one he recommended to me. Oh. Um, that's pretty good. Me, I, don't, I forgot what mine's are. Yeah, I do. I don't think I got that one. That might be that one over there. This one? Yeah, it's got a little crumbly smoke around there. <laughs> Maybe that's what it does. Oh, wow, I really like this last one. Ooh, I'm going to put this one in. I'm not sure about that one. I'm going to try this one. This one's really good. I don't even remember which one he said that was. It is, yeah. I don't even know. Because they all look alike. Okay, we're going to polish these off. We'll be back. This is the cheese and bread they give you. Suge forgot the cheese. I forgot the cheese. <laughs> so it's bread and cracker. And cracker. With and uh, strawberry jam. And some chippies. And your bread has jalapenos. Jalapenos, in it. okay. Yeah, and mine's just a cheese bread. Yeah, she got something in there. But I'm gonna go back for the cheese. <laughs> um, okay, let's dig in. Well, is this bad or what? There's my cups. And there's, there's Shook's cups. So who's going to be carrying who now? Neither of us are wine drinkers, but that was good. I think I need to move on and help her with hers, because she's not doing very good. <laughs> I need help. Alrighty. in here. show you around a little bit.
where a bus is parked. Sorry about the wind. Alright, very nice for stop one. I'm not sure how long we're going to be here. I can't imagine more than maybe 15 minutes until we move on to the next stop. Okay guys, we're wrapping up here at the wine tasting. We're gonna head off to our second place now and we'll take you with us. Hopefully no more wine because I just drank mine. <laughs> he drank mine too. <laughs> we're not wine drinkers. At all. We feel like that. Yes. So we'll see you guys in a few minutes at our next stop. Bye. Bye. Headed back to the bus. On to our next stop. Oh, we got horses out here. Shug's gonna get me. She just walked onto the bus, didn't know I stopped. But I had to get the horses. I love animals. Okay, now I better get on her. She's gonna get me. Second stop. More wine. <laughs> and maybe For cheese you. and crackers. Oh, okay. 
One more step. <laughs> This is considered, I guess, the winter season, so there's no actual grapes growing right now. I guess we'll have to come back again and do another tour when the grapes are actually out. But if you come, this is what it looks like. Depending on the time of year you come, of course. And there she They said they were giving us some wine tasting here. Yes, and we're gonna see how they make it. Oh, that's, that's right, say, we're going yeah. to like the wine cellars here, I think. Let's see where it's stored. Cut down quite a bit. You can tell at first look that these are uh, pretty young vineyards. Uh, the plant is down to 10, okay, six, seven years old. Okay. Uh, every new vineyard has to wait at least from three to five years to start making wine out of the grapes. Okay? Wow. These ones already spent that time. Going down. I did miss it. <laughs> he said one more and I saw the one. There was another one after that. Yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> We take these machines out, we'll be on top. And then we will pass all the uh, product to this machine, will turn around, and the, just the grapes will be one side, and all the treasure and the sticks will be on the other side. Then we will use the press, where we're going to crush the, all, the, all the grapes. As you can see, the windows of upstairs. If that's we use it to the or bring all the products like the juice to these tanks of gravity, you know, to start the fermentation in these tanks. That's why it's all the cost over there. This plant used to be for like more uh, more tanks, but because you're coming in uh, to the winery, we do that display right now. Okay? And then depends on the what uh, the wine maker, the time he wants to uh, make the fermentation of the wine. 
it will be the one on the on this uh, Spanish tank, and then we will take it out to put it behind you. That's a bar. There are American oak and French oak. We use the the bold ones. All right. The American oak will be uh, provide us the aromatic of the rural and floral. And the French oak, it will be provided us like more the stronger ones, like the vanillas, leather, uh, wood, you know, all the smoking. Yeah. That's what you want to find it in the French. By the moment you have a question? How many bottles does this take? For me? This is for 6,000 liters. So that's me. there will be a lot of <laughs> 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 Right. The closest we have at the back is when we start the fermentation, depends on the uh, how fast we need it or how slow we need it. Why is that? Because in this part we inject water, cold water to chill out the uh, the the juice just to stop the fermentation or going slow, you know, that's why we have that. Any question at the moment? Mm. Okay, if you want to take pictures, you can do it. And I see you right there drinking wine with me. Okay? <laughs> <laughs>
getting back on the bus. We are done with the wine sampling tasting tour. And we're gonna head back to the boat. And it's windy out. We didn't bring our camera with a microphone. We did this on our iPhones. Sorry about that. He's a good driver, but not that. <laughs> four dollars, uh, the shuttle. Right, we just got off our tour, our excursion. This is Gil. Hi. Awesome job. Very knowledgeable. Very, very. Uh, great personality. We appreciate your time. We highly recommend this tour. So we'll have the link in the bottom of our, our video. So we definitely recommend it. How long have you been doing this for? Uh, over six years now. Oh, wow. Okay. Yes. It shows. It shows. It was a great tour. So again, we highly recommend it. We appreciate you guys coming along. We'll see you on our next adventure. Bye. We see in Senada. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> Thanks, Bill. Thank you so much, guys. Have a good day. Okay. That's the end of our excursion, the wine tasting excursion. We're back at the ship. Suge was making that sound to try and get the seals to bark, as she says. There. Uh-oh. You don't like that. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Reminds me of like a pep rally or something where the guy jumps off the stage and oh, they're battling. So we're back at our ship, Navigator of the Seas. That was a good excursion. We enjoyed it. We've never done that one before. So we do recommend that if you come to Ensenada. These seals are always here on the dock every time we come. It's their place to hang out. So thanks again for coming along with us. We appreciate you taking the time out to watch our channel with our audience in the background. So we kindly ask you again, please subscribe to our channel. It really helps us out. Hit the notification bell and the like button. And we, with our little friends in the background over there, we'll see you again on our next adventure. Bye. Bye.